It is half seven right now and it is Monday morning. We are going into our final week of term. So it's my last Monday of this term. And it's just such a relief to be finishing this term up because it has been exhausting. And um, I had a little bit of a burnout last week where even though I was sleeping enough, I just felt tired a lot of the time. I kind of decided to take a very, very chill weekend. But I didn't do that much of work and I did a lot of fun stuff. I went to watch my friend Brian fence at his varsity tournament against Cambridge and he was freaking incredible. So I went with all of his friends to go watch him and support him. I took a really nice Sunday morning off as well. I went to breakfast with my friend Will and we went thrifting afterwards at this really huge vintage sale. And it was sunny out and it was just such a nice day yesterday. And yeah, for the first time this term, I felt like I had a proper weekend that was actually quite work light. So I've woken up this Monday and even though it's a little bit early, I feel really refreshed and I think it's just because I've taken a nice weekend and I'm like really, really excited to hit the week. I'm gonna do myself a little bit of breakfast today. I'm gonna eat the last bagel left. Mm. All right. <sighs> breakfast time. always save the bagel with the Nutella on for the last because I love Nutella. It's interesting because this is actually really nice and full breakfast and it's basically what I do every morning but I tend to struggle a lot with eating. Eating a good amount without feeling a lot of shame around it is something that I find difficult. An approach that I'm learning to adopt is instead of eating something and then ruminating over it for the next 12 hours to come and then restricting what I eat later in the day based on the feelings of guilt that I have over like a breakfast. I'm just trying to eat things and move on with my life. And for me, eating a really full and nourishing breakfast is a way to just start my day on the right footing, welcoming all foods into my diet. I never really talk about my eating disorder because you kind of can't see it in people. Yeah, I am getting help for this. I am feeling good about having full breakfasts and that's a feeling that I never would have felt this time last year. I bought new underwear. And look at how cute. It is like lacy on the top but it doesn't give you a wedgie at the back. I don't wear makeup on most days, but I will always, every, every, every day, wear some perfume. And it smells so feminine. It smells like what I think a successful 30-something at a fashion company would smell like. Obviously, I am none of those things, but here I am. I am gonna head to town and maybe either go to the library or a cafe. I haven't quite decided yet to just finish up my essay. We know where the music's playing. Let's go out and feel the night. It's a beautiful day today. I've arrived at the library and I'm just about to head in, but it is shut. So I will go to a cafe. <laughs>
uh, is a new doctrine we've got, which says that if, it would be, if you have an imperfect gift, How'd you find the lecture? <laughs> I know. So we're actually vlogging from the loo of the law faculty. We're washing our hands for a full 30 seconds because coronavirus. <laughs> I've started washing my hands so frequently that my knuckles have started to, to chafe. Like they hurt. So I'm gonna go get coffee with Brian at a cafe. He has got an essay to write. Usually after I write my essays in the morning, if I don't get myself back in the groove of studying, I'll just space out for the rest of the day. So it's nice. I'm gonna do a little study date. <laughs> I'm just gonna drop by the social sciences library because Brian gave me a book that he has to return. And Pembroke is a little bit far, but for me it's really convenient because it's right next to the law faculty. All right, we are here. It's a really pretty building. I'll show you around. my interview. Uh, job interviews always freak me out a little bit and um, I recorded a snippet but it was a really nice interview. Basically this internship is in Belgium and it's for business development, marketing. It's so exciting. Since like what? For Michaelmas? But we're here now. We're here now. to the changing room floor. We are popping on our ballet shoes, AKA my beautiful stripy socks. so good. I just love the feeling of dancing and listening to music and just moving your body to the music. Now it's dinner time. It's about eight. I'm gonna meet up with Will for dinner and we're gonna make some tofu wraps and it's gonna be really sweet. Hey. Hi. Look at her. Uh. No, the tofu. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
pajamas. And it is a little bit late at night. I just wanted to sign off here. Today was such an awesome day. You know when you're just bathing in that warm feeling of being surrounded by really nice people? That's kind of how I feel right now. I am about to pass the fuck out. Tomorrow morning, I've got to wake up for a morning tutorial, which is ideal. Thank you so much for watching this if you have made it all the way to this point. Thank you. If you enjoyed this video, um, feel free to stay around if you like. Leave me a comment. I love reading comments. Thanks for watching and I will see you next.